Hi everybody and welcome. I have a small haul I want to share with you. Um, Dollar Tree and Dollar General it was. So I was looking for some of these number stickers for my advent calendar boxes and I found these. So I bought a couple um, sheets of these from the Dollar Tree. I don't know if they're going to work but then I found these um, which I will use these for Christmas. These are um, bouquet bags. There's 10 of them in here. I bought a couple packs. What I'm going to use these for is when I make my uh, cups for the craft fair and the bouquet, the uh, flowers with candy and all that, that's what I'm going to use those for. So I've never seen those before and I was excited. The refrigerator, Bob. <laughs> Um, for the Advent calendar boxes, I don't know if the pens are going to fit in there, but I bought it. Um, either that or I'll be using them for my journaling books. They're really, really cute pens. And there's 12 in there for a dollar. I also bought a couple of these to um, take off and put, they'll fit in those little drawers for the Advent calendar. Whoops, sorry. They're little mini skateboards, so I thought because I can put little toys in there and then some candy um, that that would work. Also, I had got some of the yo-yos to do that with to put in there. I'm just hoping that they're going to fit in the little dinky drawers. If not, I'll be using them in my kids' gift boxes. So I've been picking up little things, and I think these will fit in there. So that way they don't just get candy. They When they open the drawer, they get a surprise. I got two of the eyeballs. I also, for the light boxes that I'm going to do, um, I bought this, like, grass stuff. And then um, some of the gnomes to put in the uh, lighted uh, lantern boxes. I bought this little thing to go in there. And then I bought this one, too. So I'm going to see how much I can fit in there and make that work. That's for my... My lantern box and when I do those um, I will show you and then I also because um, I want to go through my stamps and my dies and get rid of the ones that I don't use I bought these and I thought I could make some um, uh, like cardboard and label and uh, put them inside a, a bag uh, resealable bag and put the dies and the stamps in there and then layer them these were a dollar they're pretty good size and they're pretty uh, sturdy so I bought those for that. Then, uh, oh, this was from Walmart. This is my stain for my Advent boxes to do them in stain. That stuff was pretty pricey. This stuff was at the um, Dollar General store. These I got to put in my uh, kids' um, bags that I'm going to be doing and my planners. So there's uh what is there two four six eight in a pack so i got a couple of those ones i got this for um 20 cents i thought that would be good in my book pillows and then i got these ones which these work good in my little planners too i got these for 20 cents some gift tags i hope you can see that pretty good i got a couple packs of those um, 20 cents these little tiny books oh, there's another one of the tags and then I bought these um, treat boxes that I thought I would use either in my craft fair or for gifts for other people I bought a couple of these ones they are like that when you make them and then cookies because I always bake cookies and give them out to people and at the hall so I got those these were all a quarter a piece and then I got um, some more mugs for a quarter. So this is the time to buy them. I really like these ones. So I got a couple of those, what they had. I think they had three of those ones. And then I got two more of this one. And then were my cups that I bought. So I think I got more than enough cups. And then I was at Hobby Lobby. Because, like I said, I was on a search for numbers. I bought um, some of these um, Bible journaling books, $1.47 a piece. 
then I found this sticker book and they had 40% off I had a 40% off coupon then a 20% off your total purchase so it came like 60% so it ended up being like six dollars or five dollars it's still it was like 13 but I found all it has tons and tons of sheets of all these numbers and these numbers will fit perfect on the advent calendar boxes so that's the reason I bought it. and the rest of them I can use in my journaling books my planners but all the numbers, and then there's numbers here, I thought would work for all the Advent boxes. So it was kind of worth it for me to buy them. Then it has, like I said, a lot of different stickers and holiday stickers that I can use in the planners. So that was my haul from there. Thank you.